Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new video. And I am your lovely, awesome host. Ooh, my bad. Brokusatsu. And I'm here today to review, bro, the S6 figure art. Common Rider Cobra Geno slash Love Co. Kajaku. Uh, Geno. Peacock. Geno, I meant to say. Right here. So, yeah, uh, we're here. I'm reviewing Sakura's figure. <laughs> now, I'll be honest, it's been one year since Revice ended. Do I like the show? No, I did not like the show. I'm sorry. I still don't like it. I don't hate it. I just don't like Revice. That's just all. Oh. Love the suit. Not all, but still. Well, I love I I love base Gene figure. I love base Gene suit because it's fucking perfect with the blue, the black. Excuse me, language with the blue, black, and yellow that worked perfectly. Don't care for the character because he isn't. I just don't care for the character because he doesn't do that much for me. Because he, see, he's just there, and that's pretty much the character in a nutshell. So anyway, <laughs> we're here to review the genie figure. Now, for everyone know why did I buy this? And you said, Booker, that you weren't going to buy a figure. I did say that. I bought a figure for one reason. I wanted to complete the Revice. I wanted to complete my Revice collection. That's it. I was just missing her, and that's it. I had, I have everyone else. I have, I have E King Vice. I have Live. I have Demons. I have Evil. I have Aguilera. I have, I have everyone else. I just needed her, and that's it. I'm not buying the set, cause that set just not worth it in my opinion. So yeah. Sorry, guy. No plus, no blue plushie for Broku. So anyway, yeah, let's talk. Let's talk about the figure, the good and bad. But for starter, see, as she can actually, see, actually isn't that bad of a figure. Granted, I like Aguilera figure more, but uh, see, see, a little loose. Not that much. Her head, her head. If you hear that, her head's a little loose because there's something in here. But uh, see. See, he like all that loose, which is good. You can put, you can pose her like, and, and you can pose her at this, at this much you want to. Just be careful. Just oh boy, posing this figure is pretty fun. I'm not gonna lie. You can even you can even make her do like a kick. See, <laughs> that's pretty fun. Not the, I'm not the best for balancey to be honest. So please forgive me for that. But yeah, you can make her do a kick if you want to. <laughs> So articulation wise, not that bad. Her neck, her neck is her neck is not on a limited ball joint, which is good. See? But I will say, be careful with how you with how you play around her with her head. Because well, you don't want that to break or pop off. Just saying. Articulation is good. Any smudges on the back of the figure? Uh, no smudges. Well, actually, the answer is there, there, there are a little smudges here and there, if you can uh, see. If you move this. Yeah, there's some smudges right there on the... On this part of her... Of her pants. <laughs> no smudges over here. It's just on this part, unfortunately. There's some smudges right there. But uh, yeah, no smudges up here and all that, and uh, that's good to hear. Oh, yeah, I forgot, I forgot to say that they fit the premium Bandai. But uh, I want to say at the same time, they figure pretty, they figure it's pretty cheap to get on the aftermarket. She cost me like fifty bucks a Mandrake. 
And if I remember, it seems like what? It seems like what? I think well, what? I think sixty dollars. I think sixty or ninety when she came out. I gotta go back and check for so people forgive me, but uh, but uh, yeah. <laughs> For a so-called female character, yeah, she's definitely. Please, I'm surprised that she's. I'm surprised that she's not like expensive. Granted, at the same time, I know that Japan is not the biggest fan of revives. And I say that because uh, after the show ended, not a lot, of ki not a lot of kids and not a lot of kids and Tokyo fan bought the merchandise anymore. <laughs> they just wait for Geets to start in, and they bought all that shit up. <laughs> Oh, oh man. Okay. Okay. On to accessories. So, she has like a lot. So, she doesn't have a lot to buy. She comes with a lot of hands. But, uh, here we have the, uh, here we have the Peacock Vice stamp for her, uh, weapons. I'm just gonna keep this vice stamp inside the box because two because these vice stamps are so easy to lose and I'm not even lying about that. So in the box you go. Oh yeah, here we have a piece for her driver that you can use when uh when oh damn come on show. Here's the piece for the driver you add we can take this out and strap it out for the show that's show off the weapon because well this is a peacock right here for her hands we have well her open palm hands okay 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 girl you didn't need, you didn't need to fall down like that what the heck is this a jay-z song Oh god, not Jay Z. I'm so sorry. Anyway, here we have her like here we have her her grab hands for her weapons. I'll show off those really soon. So yeah. I'll be honest with you, these hands are not the I'll be honest with you. These hands are not that good for a weapon cut. Every time I try to pose her her weapon, do like an action pose or a decent vanilla stand pose. Her weapons always fall off these hands. It's so annoying. And here we just have her regular chill palm hands. And that's pretty much it for that. For her other accessories, well, we have this weapon that you're supposed to give to Revy or Vice, whatever it's one. And she also comes with another Vice stamp you're supposed to give to Revy, to Iki. The Mammoth Vice Stamp. The Deno Vice Stamp. See? I, don't, I honestly don't know why... I honestly don't know why I think it was necessary for them to give... Uh, to give her the weapon. To give her that weapon, but okay. But Bandai, I'm not surprised. Oh. Here we have, uh, here we have, well, <laughs> her, I, f I forgot what to call it. Here we have her weapon, I forgot what to call. Please forgive me. It's on the tip of my tongue, but I just can't, I can't remember the name of it. Her fans, yeah, here we have her fans. Her top, not her top, yeah, her fans. And, uh, well, these are used for weapons. Also, you can, uh, see... You can see love cough right there. That's the closest thing you guys gonna get from me to have love cough in my revise collection. But yeah, those are yeah, those are pretty much all her accessories. See, it doesn't cover a lot, but well, granted, I'm not granted, I'm not even mad about that. I'm actually okay with it. They should cover, she doesn't cover a lot. See, not like lies or evil, because those figures come a lot. Come out. They both have like a lot of stroppable pieces for their regular suits to jacko suits. But yeah. Anyway, on to size comparison with her. So 
just because this is we just because this is a female writer, let's compare her to past female writers. Well, to other female writers in my collection. Here we have her sister. The better character, in my opinion, Aguilera. Here we have uh, Sibella. Also, one point out, fun little fact. Uh, if I remember, I think it's Neon, Gina, and Sibella all share all share the same suit actress. And uh, I want to point out because that's cool. But also, I want to know. Also, I want to know this. Her fig. This figure is based off. This figure is based. This figure's height is based off the same height as the actress Angela May. <laughs> I want to find out. I find that funny because the figure, because these two figures are almost the exact same height. Kira's almost. She's a little bit more taller, but still, I just want to point out there. So yeah. And speaking of Neon, let's not forget my second favorite character in Geats, the cat... Fuck. The cat girl herself. Excuse my language. Oh, yeah, that goes hard. <laughs> that goes hard. That goes hard. <laughs> All right, let me let me move them out of the way. And now uh, let's get her. Uh, let, let's get her family in here as well. We we always oh, show you guys her sister. Let's show her her. Uh, let's show her her older brother. And well, her younger brother. Yes, Daiji's the youngest out of them all. He's because he's the middle child. Ah, yes, the Igarashi family. Now, that goes pretty good. It's so great to have all three of them in the collection. I do not like that. I did not like the Kamari Igarashi movie suit from the from the winter movie. <laughs> well, from the summer movie, I meant to say. Battle Familia. Well, I don't like that movie in general. <laughs> so, yeah. Although it does have Ninja Black Jiraiya from Cocky Ranger in there, and I love Cocky Ranger, but but that's it. Oh yeah, Geats is in there too. Here we have Evil, and here we have Vice. Man, she's done pretty well by next time. It's accurate too because she's the she's the short. Oh, my bad. Uh, my bad. I open my I I I I accidentally opened my bin right next to me. My bad about that. But uh this is accurate because she's the shortest out out she's the shortest out the whole main cast in the Igashi family meant to say. So yeah. If I remember I think she I think her actress is like what? Like what? Five one? And uh, I think Aguilera's actress is like, well, I think 5'3 or 5'2 because she's taller than Sakura's actress. I got to go back and check, so please forgive me on that. So here's, so here she is with the SA figure, Luke Skywalker. Oh, hold on. Let me fix his feet. Here she is with the SA figure, Luke Skywalker. And do not worry. I will do my review on this bad boy probably next year. So, yeah. And here she is with 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 uh the black series sorry with the black series Ahsoka Tano. Alright. And one more. Here she is with the Lightning Collection Green uh remaster Green Ranger with the Dragon Shield. Alright. So overall, what did I think of this figure? I actually love it. If I bought this last year, this would have been this would have been part of my top ten. Hell, if she came out this year, she would have been part of my top ten as well. But unfortunately, now nah, though, uh, she's pretty good. She's actually pretty good. Not bad. Not horrible. A little paint smudge here and there. Articulation can be on my nerves. Her weapons do not want to hold on my copy. That's fine. But uh, she's pretty good.
I can see why a lot of people love this figure. The character, I do not, I just don't see it. I'm sorry. But the figure itself, really good. And, uh, yeah. It, 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 it. <laughs> if you want, if you want to buy her, then uh, go ahead. She's on Mandarake. But at the same time, she's on, she's on Toku Like the Ball for like 90 bucks. She's premium Ben I real. Just want, just want to clarify that. Oh, I always say in the video, but I'm going to clarify again. She's P Bandai. She's pretty good. You can pose her with her sister, Aguilera. You can you can have her with her other family members, Ikin Ikin Daiji. And uh yeah. If you yeah, if yeah, also you can take a lot of good pictures with her because I took a lot of good ones with her. And uh I have like and, and uh, because I bought the figure, I also bought like a lot of army builders for her and for many army for my other Toku figure for Kamen Rider and, and Power Rangers. And uh yeah, you you'll see the you'll see you'll see some of those arm builders in the picture. But uh thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow all my social media in the description, and subscribe to my channel. Your boy's trying to hit one thousand subs this year, and we guys help, well, we can do it. I'm sorry I'm not been uploading a lot lately. I've been working nonstop every every week and uh I just don't have a time I just didn't have any time to upload. Don't worry, that's gonna change. Wait, that's gonna change next year. But uh, yeah, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow all my social media description, subscribe to my channel, put the notification button on for my, for my next video. Because well, if you guys subscribe to my channel and do that, your boy will get a thousand subs this year, and that's the goal. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching. I'll talk, guys. I'll talk to you guys next time. Peace. Bye-bye. Enjoy the pictures.